सदाशिव सरंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओ सुखम नित्यम स्वप्रकाशम व्यापक नाम रूपयो अधिष्ठान बुद्ध्यबोध्यम बुद्धिर्दृग्यप्त निर्मल अपारम सर्वेदेद्यम प्रत्यक तदेवाह न मोन्दी मे निश्चिता मति विचार सागर फिफ्थ चैप्टर पेज वन फोर्टी फाइव टॉपिक टू फोर्टी सिक्स इन द मिडल श्लोका फ्रॉम पंचदशी न प्रतीतिर्तोर्बाध किंतु मिथ्यात्मश्चय नोचे सुषुक्तिमूर्छाद मुच्चेतायत्नो जन निश्चरदास answering to the madhyama adhikari that question when it is asked by the student that question is how that mithya guru mithya vedanta can eliminate samsara or dukha dukha nivritti hi katham bhavati dukha nivritti hi means freedom from sorrow so when adrishti hi asked nishchara dasa answering and adrishti gave one example also just as the marriage water cannot eliminate the thirst of a person similarly mithya guru mithya shastram cannot eliminate the dukha of a person therefore your establishment of everything is mithya in vyavaharika will not help a student to remove his atma agnyanam atma agnyanam eva dukha nivrittihi dukha nivrittihi har dukha nivritti sambhavati by eliminating atma agnyanam alone one can be free from sorrow how mithya guru mithya vedanta eliminate is the question for that nishchala dasa said your drishtanta is a vishama drishtanta it is not a right drishtanta your drishtanta means marriage water drishtanta for the drishtanta that is uh, मिथ्या शास्त्र मिथ्या गुरु हाउ दे एलिमिनेट संसार दिस एग्जांपल यू शुड नॉट मेक यूज ऑफ सो टू क्लैरिफाई दैट क्वेश्चन ऑफ ए स्टूडेंट निश्चल दास इंट्रोड्यूसिंग थ्री ऑर्डर्स ऑफ रियलिटी थ्री ऑर्डर्स ऑफ रियलिटी आर व्यावहारिक सत्यम नंबर वन it is called objective reality or empirical reality number 2 is pratibhasika satyam projected reality number 3 is paramarthika satyam three orders of reality 
that which is seemingly existent is called vyavaharika satyam that which is permanently exist is paramarthika satyam that which never exist is tucham satyam mithya tucham <coughs> brahman is satyam because it is trikal abadhyam brahman permanently exist therefore brahman happens to be paramarthika satyam absolute truth then jagat is vyavaharika satyam it is badhyam it is negatable it can be falsified because it is seemingly existent mithya this is one type of reality vyavaharika satyam is one order of reality then absolutely non existent that which never exist you need not negate it because it doesn't exist it is called tucham like a rabbit horn we saw all these previously also just i am recollecting therefore this pratibhasika satyam is going to come later now we are seeing the vyavaharika satyam this satta trivi trividhyam is the uniqueness of advaita vedanta satta trividhyam three orders of reality vyavaharika satyam pratibhasika satyam paramarthika satyam one more you want to include tucham also so how he is going to answer two things can have can help each other two things can help each other called upakarya upakaraka bhava upakarya upakaraka sambandha is called helping each other helping each other means dream thirst can be removed by dream water two things are there dream thirst is there dream water is there how they help each other the dream water help that dreamer to remove his thirst upakari upakaraka bhav similarly two things can harm each other two things can harm each other if they belong to the same order of reality same order of reality a rope is vyavaharika satyam can be eliminated by rope snake is eliminated by rope gnana both are vyavaharika satta rope knowledge comes rope snake ignorance will go away rope knowledge comes rope snake ignorance rope snake knowledge will go away which is error that misconception will go away harm each other because same satta so either it is pratibhasika satyam same order of reality one can help each other or they if they are in vyavaharika satyam they can harm each other also so the rope gnanam removes rope snake agnya harming each other so this is the way he is presenting for that he gave one example also that is a king when he is sleeping a jackal comes and bites his leg and even though he has got soldiers all over raja vaidya is there but none of them helped him in his dream he faced that pain in spite of soldiers are there none of them protected him because soldiers and raja vaidya real raja vaidya they are vyavaharika satyam so that pain of that dream king dream jackal dream pain all can be removed by 
only dream doctor alone can remove his pain so the dream doctor dream aushadham only can help so the dream doctor dream aushadham both are vyam pratibhasika satyam swapna it is uh, both are having same order of reality vyavaharika vaidya vyavaharika aushadham cannot cure cannot remove the pain of pratibhasika king in the dream so we saw this story also elaborate so what is the final he want to say samasatta kayo ho badhya badhak bhavaha samasatta either they have to be pratibhasika satyam the pain of the king is pratibhasika satyam medicine is also pratibhasika satyam dream only and the doctor also pratibhasika satyam then the solution is possible similarly vishama satta kayoh badhya vadhak bhavah na asti ar sadhya sadhak bhavah na asti vishama satta kayoh vishama satta ka means pratibhasika satyam and vyavaharika satyam both are vishama satta ka one is projected reality another is uh, uh, objective reality relative reality therefore sadhya sadhaka bhavah na asti <coughs> so therefore what uh, he wants to explain and uh, elaborate uh, define that uh, what are these sat- satyams he want to define uh, satta trividhyam defining first we are seeing vyavaharika satta topic number 246 <coughs> in visishta advaita visa the dream also is real for them dream is also created by god only ishvara srishti only jagat srishti is also ishvara swapna srishti is also ishvara according to visishta advaita therefore they have only two one is real one is unreal what we experience is real what we don't experience is unreal for them there are only two orders of reality sat and asat but for us there is one more between sad sat <coughs> that which is real also and which is unreal also an inquiry so this difference we have to note so advaita says uh, these the orders of reality will help us to know this vyavaharika prapancha is mithya in all other matams only uh, real and unreal are there but our uniqueness is uh, four we have okay broadly three we make use of it so first we take up the vyavaharika satta vyavaharika satta alone called maya maya karyam jagrat prapancha is maya karyam a product of maya belong to vyavaharika satta instead of using maya that maya word is used for junior students but here nichara das are using when to we talk about jiva uh, ishvara and prapancha we talk about maya but uh, if you want to become a senior student suppose so he replaced that maya word as uh, moola vidya another name of maya is moola vidya so moola vidya he is using that word where this mula vidya locate na it is existing in my mind only mula vidya is existing in my mind only where is mind mind is in my body body mind and thoughts also all belong to the mula vidya mula vidya located mula vidya another name is atma avidya atma avidya is called mula vidya 
so i am the creator of jagrat prapancha also this is for senior students first we say ishvara created this world for junior students that is maya sahitam brahma saguna ishvara created the world when you are a senior student mula vidya we use this mula vidya i am the creator of jagrat prapancha also Mm, from me alone i am the means of i the atma chaitanyam i create jagrat prapancha through mula vidya i create swapna prapancha through mula vidya so like that we have to understand through total mula vidya total mula vidya samashti self ignorance jagrat prapancha the entire jagrat prapancha is created through samashti mula vidya through vyashti mula vidya swapna prapancha is created that's why our swapna prapancha is subjective reality nobody knows about our swapna therefore it is called subjective reality but the world which is created by samashti mula vidya is known to everyone many people know the whole world all objects they are seeing therefore it is called objective world from kaivalya upanishad we can get this clarity mayeva sakalam jatam mai sarvam pratishthitam mai sarvam layam yati when this word comes if you are a senior student immediately remember mai eva sakalam jatam everything is born out of me everything is created by means which me from me atma chaitanya born means what everything is born out of me means how can you say born out of me i lend existence the whole world borrows existence from me clip borrows existence clip is when i say is ness of uh, clip is uh, not uh, belong to the clip that belongs to me the atma chaitanyam clip borrows existence is ness from me because i the consciousness chaitanyam atma chaitanyam is the lender of is ness to the pen to the book everything for every object i am the lender that is why example i said moonlight does not belong to the moon moonlight is not of the moon moonlight in the moon is not of the moon i'll repeat once again moonlight is not of the moon moonlight in the moon is not of the moon similarly existence in the world world exist house is there man is there pen is there book is there that isness is not of the book isness is not of the clip isness in the clip is not of the clip isness in the house is not of the house it is belong to me i am the lender of the isness to the house i say house is pen is book is man is she is he is i am lending existence that is called born we say mai eva sakalam jatam means because of my and uh, because of me the isness giver i am the observer i lend isness to every nama roopa prapancha that is presented as mai eva sakalam jatam so literally you, sh- you should not take everything is born out of me means uh, uh, it looks like a joke how oh, everything and born out of me na? so you have to see the implied meaning be hidden meaning in the upanishads how lakshana ya it says na? you have to see the hidden meaning everything is born out of me means everything is existing because of me everything is existing because of me means existence of every object is borrowed from me because every object is jadam by itself they cannot reveal themselves so i the consciousness 
Chaitanyam Brahma, I am the lender of easiness for everything. Therefore, Upanishad says, Mayeva Sakalam Jatam. So, it is not easy to just listen the mantra and read the meaning of the mantra. Everything is born out of me, is the literal meaning. What do you get out of it? Nothing. That is why Guru is required to reveal the hidden meaning. So, Guru has got that key to open the vakyam. So, is there... Now, the question is, in this... Uh, he is telling um, Panchadashikara, telling Vidyaranya is telling. Pratitihi Badhaha means here not Telugu Badha. Badha in Telugu is pain. Here Badhaha means negation. Negation Pratiti Tayoho Badhaha Na Apratitihi. Negation of any Vyavaharika Vastu. Negation is not the cessation of the world experience. Na apratiti. Na apratiti. Badha means what? Nimithyatva nishayam. World is falsified. World is negated. What do you mean by world is negated? World disappears. Pratiti goes away. Pratiti means experience. Can it go away? It will not go away. Na apratitihi. Badaha na apratitihi. Negation is not disappearance. Kintu. Then what? Mithyatva nischayaha. Mithyatva means false. It is a false world. Seemingly appearance. Apparently there. Existence is not originally belong to the world, the reality of the world belongs to the Brahman, that reality is easiness, world is not there really, it is only seeming appearance, it is called Mithyatva Nishchaya. So disappearance itself, it is uh, um, samsara nivrittihi bhavechet, what he says, second line, sushuptihi murchadau. In deep sleep, apratitihi is there, nothing we are experiencing in deep sleep. And murcha, the epileptic people, epilepsy, those who are having murcha, suddenly they become unconscious. They do not know anything, blackout. So in blackout time also, pratiti is not there. If apratiti not experience alone is moksha, in deep sleep we would have gone, got moksha long before. In Murcha also that people would have attained moksha. Therefore, after knowledge also world experience will be there. World disappearance will not take place in spite of knowledge. Brahma Jnana. Therefore, um, Sushupti Murchadav. No Chet. Means no Chet means what? If Pratiti also goes away. If it is not Mithyatva Nishayam, it is not only falsification. If really this world disappears, Sushupti also it disappears, Murcha also it disappears. Mucheta, hmm? Mucheta uh, Ayatnataha, person would have attained Mukti long before without any effort. But sleep, what effort we are putting? Her sleep, what effort we are putting? Nothing. Ayatnataha mucheta. Everybody attain, has got attain, attainment of moksha in a sleep. But uh, sleep is not giving moksha for us. Morning you wake up again, dukkha comes. Hmm? Therefore, mucheta ayatnataha janaha. People would have attained moksha if. Um, non-experience alone is moksha, people would have attained moksha long before. Long before, because they sleep, uh, no experience, murcha, they no experience. Therefore, non-experience is not uh, the definition of moksha. Apratiti is not the definition of moksha. That is the idea. Chitradipa Prakranam Panchadasi Visam. 13th verse, 6th chapter. 
up to here we saw in the last class now the next sloka also he continues the same topic i will read that portion paramatma vasheshu hi tat satyat pravinishchaya na jagat vismrutir no ched jeevan muktir na sambhavet paramatma avasheshaha avasheshaha means remainder remainder avasheshaha what paramatma the consciousness chaitanyam tat satyatva vinishchayaha atma vinishchayaha paramatma chaitanyam alone is left out remainder avasheshaha means remainder after negating everything i the consciousness chaitanyam alone remain the negator can never be negated unnegatable negator can negate everything <coughs> paramatma avasheshaha hi that alone is tat satyatva vinishchayaha tat means atma atma satyatva nischayaha i am atma the satyam i am never negated by anything i remain always trikala abadhyam unnegatable at any period of time na jagat vismrutihi not uh, forgetting the world not disappearance of world paramatma alone is there atma chaitanyam alone is there is atma uh, nischayam alone is called brahma gnanam satyatva vinishchaya atma alone is satyam tadanyat sarvam mithya iti gnano but not jagat vismruti once you get gnanam you forget about the world and nobody will come to vedanta class <laughs> once you come to swamini class you listen to vichara sagara or you listen to naishkarma siddhi bhashya mandal you get atma gnanam the whole world disappears and who will come to vedanta class hmm? nobody will come to vedanta class people will be afraid of vedanta class so happily if you are all listening from many years nothing happened to you your family your children husband children all grandchildren or your house everything is intact everything is intact thank god that's why you are continuing the world you are continuing the world experience you are continuing the vedanta shastra so guru also continuing his teaching suppose guru also got a gnanam and he also not seeing the world and what he will teach Hmm? all disappears suppose after gnanam guru cannot teach any atma vidya nobody no teaching will take place everything is fun so na jagat vismruti there is no forgetfulness of the world forgetfulness of the world is not there vismruti is not there after knowledge paramatma avaseshaha eva atma satyatva nischaya it is not jagat vismruti we don't want jagat vismruti we want only to establish jagat satyatva buddhi there is no reality in the world that means there is no reality in the duality world means duality dvaitam there is no dual reality in the duality of the world that reality is only easiness that reality of that world nama roopa bheda is only your erroneous perception na jagat vismruti he very very important shlokas these two shlokas we saw in panchadashi also in english no chet otherwise vimukti hi na sambhavet jeevan mukti hi na sambhavet if this is not uh, Uh, so what will happen jagat vismrutihi bhavet chet <coughs> while living i forget the world when i get atma gnanam suppose i forget the world world will, will disappear for me how can you call that is jeevan mukti 
while I am alive, while I am alive, you know, I am a Jivanu Muktaha. How can you say so? How can you have that knowledge? It's not possible. Therefore, he says, no chet. If it is not so, Jagat Vismurtihi na sambhavati. Jagat Smurtihi bhavati eva. Parantu satyatvam uh, nishkarshat. That means we have removed the satyat. That's all. World is as it is. Like a fried seed. It cannot sprout. Like defanged cobra. It cannot bite. Gnani does not give satyatvam to the world. Therefore, world cannot trouble him or trouble her. Because it is like a defanged cobra or it is like a fried seed. Fried seed is so sweet, tasty. Okay. Like that, whole world is more enjoyable. Jeevan Mukti na sambhavet eva. Jeevan Mukti is not possible while living. So these two slokas, enough to understand the exact essence of Vedanta. Next paragraph. I am che aparoksha mithyatva nishchayaha. Ishwara Srishta Padartheshu Brahma Jnana Prag Na Kasma Na Kasya Chida Pibhavati Kintu Brahma Jnana Dhanantarameva Tadrisha Nishchayaha Bhavati Ataha Mula Avidya Karya Jagrat Padarthatma Kaim Pradharthatma Kaim Ishwara Srishto Vyavaharika Satta Vidyate Janma Marana Janma Marana Bandha Moksha Di Akhila Vyavahara Siddhi Prayojika Satta Vyavaharika Satta iti varnyate. What is Vyavaharika Satta? Consolidation. Now he gives that is I am this Aparoksha Mithyatva Nishayaha. Directly I understand my Guru says, therefore this world is Mithya. No. Once you understand Mahavakya clearly, once you understand Mahavakya clearly, Directly you understand world is mithya. Aparoksha mithyatva nischayaha. Directly you understand this world is mithya. Nischayaha. Firmly. Yeah, without any doubt. Doubtless knowledge. Whole this world is mithya. What is this world? Ishvara. Srishta. Padartheshu. This Padartheshu means in all these objects. Whatever you see, whatever you see in this world, Padarthas, they are all created by Ishvara. Ishvara Srishta. Brahma Jnana Prak, before Brahma Jnana, na kasya chidapi bhavat. This Mithyatva Nishayam is not possible before Brahma Jnana. That means what? After Brahma Jnana alone, Mithyatva Nishayam is possible. After self-knowledge alone, falsification of the world is possible. Not before Brahma Jnana. Not before knowing that I am Brahman. Aham Brahmasmi Jnana. Jnanat Purvam Na Sambhavat. For anyone. People just they talk hmm? but never believe in that. They talk what? I know all this, everything is Mithya. <clears throat> Have you understood Mahavakya? He says, no, no, I don't know what is Mahavakya. Then how can you know? <laughs> Therefore, Nischaya word is always used. Mithyatva Nischayam. That is possible only after Brahma Jnana to Prak. Not possible. Before Brahma Jnana, it is not possible. After Brahma Jnana alone is possible. What is possible? Mithyatva Nishchayam. Mithyatva Nishchayam of what? Of this world. Which world? That which is created by the Ishwara. 
किंतु ब्रह्मज्ञानाद अनंतरमेव बट इट इज आफ्टर ब्रह्मज्ञानम अलोन अनंतर मीन्स आफ्टर ब्रह्मज्ञान मीन्स अहम ब्रह्म अस्मि देर फॉर फ्रॉम मी अलोन दिस होल वर्ल्ड इज रईजिंग एंड सस्टेनिंग एंड डिसॉलविंग यू ई गिव लैंड एक्सीस्टेंस इट एक्सीस्ट अदरवैज इट कैनाट एक्सीस्ट तादृश निश्चय निश्चय दट टाइप आफ् निश्चय कन्फर्म कन्फर्मिटी विल टेक् प्लेस आफ्टर ब्रह्मज्ञान अलोन अतः देर फोर देर फोर मीन एक्सीस्टे इन द वर्ल is uh, borrowed from me it doesn't have its own existence so ishwara is creator of the world now um, he says maya is the creator of the world maya means moola vidya <coughs> so ishwara doesn't have videha mukti ishwara doesn't have videha mukti whatever is available here maya and maya karyam belong to vyavaharika satta so he says avidya karyam moola vidya moola avidya moola vidya basic self ignorance moola vidya karya what is that product of moola vidya jagrat prapancha जागृत पदार्थ आत्म के जागृत पदार्थ बेकिंग वर्ल्ड वाट एवर यू सी वाट यू सी ईश्वर सृष्टि ईश्वर सृष्ट इन दिस ईश्वर सृष्टि व्यावहारिक सत्ता विद्यते देर ईज रिटिव आर्डर ऑफ रियालीटी और ऑब्जेक्टिव रियालीटी और एम्फेरिकल रियालीटी ईज देर इन द वर्ल्ड जन्म वाट आर् देर इन दिस व्यावहारिक सत्ता वर्ल्ड जन्म बर्थ ईज देर we are talking about birth date of birth hmm? uh, today night new year porakkarade na not only human beings year also uh, people talk about new year is born janma human beings we take janma marana death bandha bondage moksha freedom <coughs> adi padat all hunger thirst <laughs> Mm. Uh, and other pains emotional problems minds thought mind thought etc etc akhila akhila vyavahara siddhi prayojika all vyavahar mm. all vyavahara akhila vyavahara from morning to till night until sleep how much vyavahara we does however however much interaction we are doing प्रयोजिका बेनिफिट इज देयर प्रयोजिका सत्ता दैट रियलिटी वेयर वी हैव लॉट ऑफ इंटरेक्शन विद द पीपल फैमिली मेंबर्स फ्रेंड्स रिलेटिव्स सत्ता व्यावहारिक सत्ता इति वर्ण्यते इट इज डिस्क्राइब्ड एज डिफाइंड एज व्यावहारिक सत्ता व्हाट इज व्यावहारिक सत्ता होल वर्ल्ड व्हाट इज वर्ल्ड पदार्थ names and objects how they are created created by ishwara so when you interact with this ishwara srishti padartha objects it is called vyavaharika satta whatever is falsified by brahma gnanam or atma gnanam is vyavaharika satta definition is whatever is negated falsified by brahma gnanam is vyavaharika satta is the simple definition what is objective reality what is vyavaharika satta suppose anybody asks when you once you get self knowledge you can negate this world you can not you not you can you will negate this world that is called vyavaharika satta It's a beautiful definition. You know where in any text you get this much clear uh, explanation of different orders of reality. Now with this vyavaharika satta is over. Now he comes to uh, pratibhasika satta. So there is another mula vidya 
అండ్ తూల విద్య బ్రహ్మ అజ్ఞానం అలోన్ ఈజ్ కాల్డ్ మూలా విద్య మూలా విద్య ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు బ్రహ్మ అజ్ఞానం తూల విద్య మీన్స్ ఎనీ అదర్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ అదర్ దాన్ బ్రహ్మన్ ఎనీ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ అదర్ దాన్ సెల్ఫ్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ ఈజ్ కాల్డ్ తూల విద్య దిస్ ఆల్సో విస్ అ లాంగ్ బిఫోర్ దట్ మీన్స్ కెమిస్ట్రీ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ మ్యూజిక్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ ఎనీ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ ఎనీ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ అబౌట్ ఎనీథింగ్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ వరల్డ్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్స్ ఈజ్ కాల్డ్ తూల విద్య మూల విద్య తూల విద్య బ్రహ్మ అజ్ఞానం ఈజ్ కాల్డ్ మూల విద్య అదర్ దాన్ బ్రహ్మన్ వాట్ ఎవర్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ యూ హ్యావ్ గాట్ ఎనీ సైన్స్ నాలే ఇగ్నరెన్స్ ఎనీ ఫుడ్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ ఎనీ పర్సన్స్ ఇగ్నరెన్స్ యూ హ్యావ్ దట్ పర్సన్ ఐ డూ నాట్ నో దిస్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ ఐ డూ నాట్ నో దిస్ ఐ డూ నాట్ నో దిస్ ఈజ్ ఐ డూ నాట్ నో ఇఫ్ యూ సే దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ తూల విద్య ఓకే దట్ ఈస్ ద డిఫరెన్స్ బిట్వీన్ మూల విద్య అండ్ తూల విద్య త్రూ మూల విద్య ఆత్మ అజ్ఞానం ఐ క్రియేట్ జాగ్రత్త ప్రపంచ త్రూ మూల విద్య ఐ క్రియేట్ మూల విద్య త్రూ మూల విద్య ఐ క్రియేట్ స్వప్న ప్రపంచ ఐ క్రియేట్ స్వప్న ప్రపంచ త్రూ తూల విద్య మూల విద్య తూల విద్య ఐ క్రియేట్ స్వప్న ప్రపంచ through tula vidya that means i don't know um, myself as jagrat purusha then i project everything in uh, swapnam or in jagrat prapancha also i don't know this object that artha dhyasa gnana dhyasa that is a different topic now we have pratibhasika satta next topic 247 is ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్త సో ఎనీ జ్ఞానం వ్యావహారిక జ్ఞానం వా ప్రాతిభాసిక జ్ఞానం వా జ్ఞాన అబాధ్యత్వం ఈజ్ పారమార్థిక సత్యం సో ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్యం ఆల్సో వెన్ యూ వేక ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్యం గోసవే ఓకే ఇఫ్ యూ నెగేట్ జాగ్రత్త ప్రపంచ స్వప్న ప్రపంచ is there anything something that he comes in the next topic 248 paramarthika satya before that in between there is one more satta pratibhasika satta now i will read this portion so what he says pratibhasika satta brahma gnane tar badhyatvam pratibhasikatvam తాదృశం సత్వం యాస్తే సహ ప్రాతిభాసిక పదార్థ ఇత్యుచ్యే బ్రహ్మజ్ఞానం వినా ఏవ రజ్జు శుక్తికోషో శుక్తి కోశర శుక్తికోషరాది జ్ఞానేన యథాక్రమం సర్ప రజత ఉదకాం బాధదర్శనాత్ తేషాం ప్రతి ప్రాతిభాసికం సత్వమస్తి ప్రాతిభాసిక ప్రతీతి కాల మాత్ర సత్తాక సత్తాస్వరూపం స్థితి ప్రతీతి కాల మాత్ర భావి పదార్థ ప్రతి ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్తా ఉచ్యతే తూలా విద్యా కార్య శుక్తి రజత రజతాదే ప్రతీతి కాలమాత్రాత్షాం ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్తాయుజ్యే వెరీ నైస్ వెరీ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ నో వాట్ ఈస్ ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్తా ప్రొజెక్టెడ్ రియాలిటీ ఇన్ వి నో ఆల్ దిస్ ఇన్ విసా ఇన్ ఆల్ ఉపనిషత్స్ వాట్ డూ యూ మీన్ బై ప్రాతిభాసిక సత్తా వాట్ ఎవర్ ఈజ్ ఫాల్స్ వైడ్ by brahma gnana itara gnana he says brahma gnana itara vadhyatvam pratibhasika sat pratibhasikatvam it is pratibhasika sattva is called subjective reality any ignorance any ignorance other than 
other than self ignorance is tula vidya anything other than self ignorance is called tula vidya uh, food ignorance fan ignorance tv ignorance or computer ignorance or any ignorance other than brahma gnanam is called tula vidya so pratibhasika brahma gnana itara bhadhyatva that means what pratibhasikatva means um, that which is uh, negated by that knowledge which is not brahma gnana which cannot be negated by brahma gnana then how it is negated tadrusha satyam yatra aste saha pratibhasika padarthaha ityuchyate brahma gnana itara bhadhyatvam means whatever is falsified by brahma gnana itara gnana other than brahma gnanam whatever gnanam removes that object ignorance it is called pratibhasika satyam ityuchyate brahma gnanam vina eva vitor brahma gnanam so rajju sarpa gnanam to remove require brahma gnanam to remove ropes ne knowledge you don't require brahma gnanam you require what gnanam rop gnanam clear brahma gnanam vina without uh, the necessity or requirement of brahma gnanam whatever agnanam is removed is called tula vidya that is tula vidya is removed by normal knowledge rajju shukti that means rope knowledge shukti shell knowledge ushara uda ushara means um, land knowledge gnanena by this gnanam yatha kramam yatha kramam sarpa that means rajju sarpa gnanam will go away by rajju gnanam rajju gnanam rajju agnanam alone is the cause of rajju sarpa gnanam therefore uh, sarpa um, rajata means a shell shell uh, when you see the silver shell knowledge removes the sh- silver knowledge uh, which is erroneous and udakana udakam is erroneous perception mirage water perception that can be removed by what ushara adignan ushara gnanena what you have to do respectively kramaina means yatha uh, krama means uh, rajju gnanena sarpa gnanam nashyati shukti gnanena rajata gnanam nashyati similarly ushara gnanena if you know it is land udaka gnanam nashyati nashyati means baadha baadha darshanat baadha means sublation negation darshanat tesham pratibhasikam satvam asti they have pratibhasika projected sub- subjective reality pratibhasika is equal to pratita kala matra sattaka pratibhasika means what pratita kala as you are experience that a time alone it will be there what roof snake you are experiencing that time alone it can be there once you put light torch light or somebody comes they say this is not a rope snake it is a rope then it will disappear so only at the time of experience it appears mirage water no mirage water no mirage water go near if you go near what you is there what is there only land so pratiti kala matra satta only for some time few seconds until you know the land that water uh, appearance will be there until you know the rope sarpa appearance will be there until you know it is shell until you know it is shell what appear silver appearance will be there that is why pratiti kala matra satta kaha 
सत्ता मीन्स वाट स्वरूपम स्वरूप मीन्स वाट स्थिति ही ओके स्वरूपम इट्स अ नेचर एक्जिस्टेंस प्रतीति काल मात्र भाविना पदार्थ से प्रातिभासिक सत्ता उच्चते व्हाट डू बी मैं प्रातिभासिक सत्ता दैट ऑब्जेक्ट हुचे एक्जिस्ट ओनली एट द टाइम ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस दैट ऑब्जेक्ट हुचे एक्सपीरियंस ओनली एट द टाइम ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस दैट इज कॉल्ड प्रातिभासिक सत्ता थूला विद्या कार्यम शुक्ति रजता दे ही शुतुला विद्या दैट इग्नोरेंस ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट शुक्ति रजता आदि है शुक्ति में शेल शेल सिल्वर तूला विद्या शेल सिल्वर अपीयरिंग बिकॉज़ ऑफ शेल इग्नोरेंस रोक्स ने किस अपीयरिंग बिकॉज़ ऑफ रोप इग्नोरेंस वाटर इज अपीयरिंग बिकॉज़ ऑफ लैंड इग्नोरेंस प्रतीति काल मात्र भावित्वाद सिंस इट इज existing only at the time of experience not all the time tesham pratibhasika satta yujyate it is proper to call pratibhasika satta you can say anatma agnyanam is called tula vidya anatma agnyanam means what <laughs> rop is anatma shell is anatma बुक इज अनात्मा मैक इज अनात्मा कंप्यूटर इज अनात्मा फैन इज अनात्मा ऐ हेव फैन इग्नोरेन्स इट इज कॉल तूला विद्या इफ ऐ हेव लाइट इग्नोरेन्स ऐ हेव तूला विद्या सो अविद्या मीन्स इग्नोरेन्स तूला विद्या मीन्स ऑब्जेक्ट इग्नोरेन्स सो अनात्म अज्ञान इज कॉल तूला विद्या सर इो इं प्रती काल वर्ड इज दट इज experience la aramicha swami ji used this word experience la aramicha um adi vande pratibhasika sat vyavaharika satta pratibhasika satta experience la aramicha existence la aramicha adi vyavaharika satta okay experience pratiti la arambi if you start it is called pratibhasika satya pratiti If you say this is that is this is that is existence, so if you start, it is called vyavaharika satta. Whatever is created by self ignorance is vyavaharika satta. Whatever is created by you know projected ignorance is called pratibhasika satta. Whatever is uh, created by that. Uh, ऑब्जेक्टिव इग्नोरेंस ना अनात्मा अज्ञान अनात्मा में सारे ऑब्जेक्ट्स सर अनात्मा दैट इग्नोरेंस इज कॉल्ड तूला विद्या ओके दिस इज कॉल्ड प्रातिभासिक सत्ता विद दिस प्रातिभासिक सत्ता इज ओवर आत्मा अज्ञानम इज अलोन कॉल्ड मूला विद्या कंप्यूटर अज्ञानम इज कॉल्ड तूला विद्या ओके हाउस अज्ञानम इज कॉल्ड व्हाट मूला विद्या तूला विद्या तूला विद्या अदर देन आत्मा अज्ञान एवरी थिंग इज तूला विद्या एवरी इग्नोरेंस इज तूला विद्या सो मूला विद्या आत्मा अज्ञान गोस बै आत्मा ज्ञान तूला विद्या अज्ञान गोस बै दट आबजेक्ट नॉलेज इट गोस एर फोर नौ ही इज गोइंग टू एंटर into paramarthika satta the third one i will read this portion he completes in two lines paramarthika satta paramarthika satta kalatraya vadhyatvam paramarthika satvam chaitanyam ekameva na kadapi vadhyate iti पारमार्थिक सत्ता चैतन्यस्य एव एंड इन प्रातिभासिक सत्य व्हेन वी आर टॉकिंग इज देयर एनीथिंग सम इज देयर यस 
anything that which is unnegatable suppose you ask in this uh, uh, 247 which we completed pratibhasik sattva logically there must be uh, something uh, which is unnegatable why to come to paramarthika satyam why can't we stop with uh, vyavaharika satyam and pratibhasika satyam Pratibhaska Satyam, Swapnam is negated, Rupsnik is negated, sil shell silver negated, and uh, marriage water negated. Pratibhaska Satyam. What about this world? Jagratha Prapancha also negated. Everything negating, negating, negating. If you are going on negating everything, is there anything possible that which is unnegatable? Logically, if you ask, yes, it is possible. How it is possible? Logically, there must be something that which is unnegatable. Why we have to ask like that? Nah, if everything is sublated, negated, Jagrat is negated, Swapna is negated, there must be um, some, that they must be false. Jagrat is negated and Swapna is negated, therefore Swapna is false, Jagrat is false. Then what you require, what is the definition of false? Uh, world is false, we said. Jagrat is false, we, uh, Swapna is false, we said. What do you mean by, what do you mean by false? What is the definition of false? No. Uh, Nishalada says, false is that which enjoys borrowed existence. This uh, meaning is hidden. False is that which borrows, um, which enjoys borrowed existence. Sopna exists because of Vekar. Vekar exists because of me, the Atma Chaitanyam. So false is that which enjoys borrowed existence. How we have to understand this? Easiness. Easiness is borrowed in them. In Jagrat also easiness is borrowed. Jagrat means uh, this is, that is, this is, that is, I am talking. Borrowed, it is borrowed. Existence is borrowed. And we don't say moonlight is uh, absent. We don't say moonlight is absent. What we say? We say moonlight is borrowed from the sunlight. Moonlight has got borrowed existence. Why? Because it doesn't have its own light. Moonlight is whose light? Sunlight. Therefore, moonlight has got borrowed existence. Like that, here also, similarly, Jagrat Prapancha is absence we don't say moonlight is absent we don't say moonlight is not real we say moonlight is absent we say moonlight is there for me moonlight appears then uh, can we give reality to that moonlight no moonlight is borrowed from sunlight therefore moonlight is uh, false Moonlight experience is not false. Moonlight experience is real, but moonlight is false. Like that here also, uh, Jagrata Prapancha is absent, we don't say. We say Jagrata Prapancha has got borrowed existence. Jagrata Prapancha has got borrowed existence. <coughs> so the existence in Jagrata Prapancha does not belong to Jagrata Prapancha. Hmm? For example, easiness in the pen, clip, um, all of them doesn't belong to pen and clippers. They belong to me, the Chaitanya. Clip is my case. Clip can never say I exist. Clip can never say I exist. I have to say clip is. So the clip exists because of me. We will see in the next class. Okay. Pur namadah pur namidam pur nat pur namudachyate 
ಪೂರ್ಣಸ್ಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮಾಧಾಯ ಪೂರ್ಣಮೇವಾವಶಿಷ್ಯತೆ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಹರಿ ಓಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಓಂ